Isn't that so satisfying? Okay, let's get started. Hi friends, family, and anyone else who cares to watch. This is day one of making an alien. Let's go. For the face sketch, I wanted to make sure it was something that was just super animated and cool. Because, you know, you're making an alien, you can do whatever you want. Why be boring? Like, that's what I always hated about, like, some art styles. It's like, you can make whatever you want and you choose to make something boring. Okay, so I'm done sketching the face. I just have to build it tomorrow because that's when our Amazon package gets here. All right, guys, look what came in. We have our head here. So we're going to start building the alien. Isn't that so satisfying? Okay, let's get started. <laughs> So what we're actually building it with is this Jovi air dry clay. I'm pretty sure it's made for children, but you know, it. on his first reaction to this clay, it is so wet. This is styrofoam and you can't put it in the oven. So I mean, you could, it would just be really dumb. So this is what we have so far. Okay, so for sculpting the face, this was where the real challenge came in because it is just so mushy. It's like sculpting with paper mache. And if you've ever done that, you know it sucks. Like it's not fun at all. And the worst part is it's air dry. So if you have like a little piece that's like this big and it dries out for whatever reason, you can't use it anymore. So I had to constantly cover it like multiple times to make it work. So we're done sculpting. Now it's time to actually paint this guy. This is what he looks like now. Kind of creepy, I know, but we're gonna make him green. So let's go do that. And by the way, I'm gonna use Flex Seal. Hi everyone, so we're doing an unboxing. This do we look alike? Let me know in the comments. Look at this. Yeah, but we gonna have to get you checked in. Why? <laughs> that, that's not okay. Are you, are you judging my artwork? That's not okay. That ain't artwork at this point. You know what? You, you can leave now. Me nah, and, bro. Me and Junior are good. In fact, I'm leaving by choice. Right, Junior? Because now you look crazy. Catch it. Crazy. Right. <laughs> So my first plan was to just 3D print the eyes because I thought that would be easier and it would look cooler. But then I realized that drawing them on would probably be the best option. And I ended up really liking how it looks. Like it's 2D, it's flat, and it looks good. With the 3D printing, I had to like stick it on with super glue and that was so much work. And I didn't really want to do any more work after what comes next. By the way, the reason why I mix so much green paint is because one of the worst things that can happen is you mix up like a good amount of paint, but then it's not enough. So then you have to remix it but now it doesn't match because the first one was like very specific and now you're kind of screwed over so always mix extra paint all right so basically the situation is we're waiting for our paint to dry and i'll do the final reveal in a second but for now let's play some roblox alien games and see what they have so the recording just started well, how, do, how do you get on the plane i just want to fly am i late to my t am i late i think i'm late okay so I th that's the plane it's clearly already done for and guys please don't talk about my character i'm sorry i'm not spending any of my own money to make it look any better so you're just gonna have to deal with it truthfully it's not changing so okay how do you get on the plane i'm not buying an outfit they're all ugly okay 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 that's the crash but where where's the next flight like come on how do I change my camera? That's how do I uh, this is your gifted speaker. I don't want this view. The weather is very nice today. Uh, yeah, like 27B. Open the door. Come on. I want to jump. This guy? Uh, this ladies guy? and gents, please fasten your seatbelts. Okay, we may experience a bit of rough air. Okay, we're, we're making some progress here. I'm still not sure what I'm supposed to do, but. Wait, I'm outside. <laughs> so no, we no, are no, headed no, no, back no. down Wait, a bit I, more. How did I do Get that? out of some rough spots. What? Where's the parachute? Keep your seatbelts fastened at this time. Captain Where down. am I? This, this isn't even in the game anymore. Yeah, I just fell in out of the plane and died, which I guess is cool. So basically, my alien legs didn't want to dry, so I have to clean up all the paint and then repaint them a different color. Yeah. 
Ew, look at that, look. Look how gross that is, okay. We had to take a quick little break because my dog was thirsty and that comes as a priority over everything else. He drank out of the baby head, of course, because what else would he drink out of? But then I had to scrub off all the green gunk from the plastic, which was very frustrating because it did not come off. There's still some green gunk in the bucket as we speak. I honestly do not plan on removing it because that sounds like way too much work. But if any of you have any tips on how I can solve that, please let me know. It would be really helpful. Yeah, that's what that looks like. This is what I'm struggling with, guys. Hi guys, so using my inference skills, I think it's best if I prime it and then paint it tomorrow because what happened today was just not good. Let me show you. So there's still some paint on it, but this is like the best I'm gonna do. It's not getting any better than this. So I'm gonna prime it and then paint it and hopefully that makes it better. We'll see tomorrow. Okay, so we're gonna play Escape Piggy. It looks like Peppa Pig, but like, wait, I'm the piggy. I don't even know what the piggy is. What is the piggy? How do I, oh my God. There's a story? I didn't realize Roblox games had stories. Oh, there, well, there we are. I can't move. Oh wait, now I can. Come on, <laughs> come on, Mimi. Hey, got one. Hey, friend. <laughs> Welcome to the team. <laughs> okay, I see a little trauma thing. But right, if they are, come on. Don't be afraid of Piggy. Hey, we got another one. Look at us. Look at us. Go team. Go team. Okay. Game over. Not bad. I think I did really good as Piggy, honestly. Like, that was a lot of hard work. I don't know why, but painting this reminded me of that one scene in Shrek. Like, if you've ever seen, I think it's Shrek 2 or 3, when they have babies. Like, that's exactly what this reminded me of. I feel like I should actually bake my own, like, Shrek at some point. That would be really funny. But at the same time, if, like, no nobody wants to watch it then there's no point so just let me know if you want to see that and I, I don't know Shrek content might be overdone but I honestly think it's really funny especially those like CGI animations those are hilarious and like dancing Shrek or or have you guys seen that guy on TikTok that like makes a Shrek CGI and it like chases him around like a dog or something oh no the funniest one was like the Shrek at the pet competition that was gold that was hilarious whoever made that 10 out of 10. all right guys it's finally ready let's let me show you what we're well what i built all right so here he is all 75 pounds One question do we look alike okay so we have to put a beanie on him to see what it would look like <laughs> what are you doing get out of the <laughs> get out of Okay, so we're gonna put a beanie on him to make him look more like me. Look at him. Do we look alike? Everyone comment yes or no. I know I've been asking that question a lot. I'm just genuinely curious. Okay, what else can I put on him? I feel like a hoodie would like really tie it all together and maybe some like off whites or something, but I don't know if that's in the budget. So if you wanna get us a pair, make sure you like send it to my address maybe even we should 3d print like a pair of sneakers like this pair they would look good on him but they're too small so maybe in the next episode we'll make that a thing let me know your thoughts on that so what's your favorite thing about being an alien you know let me know what you think about earth do you like the vibe do you want to go back home just thoughts earth is prison for aliens i was sent here for selling substances to miners back home no, seriously, everyone's so annoying here, and it's like, there's no manners, people don't know how to talk to each other, everyone's always fighting. I had to take an Uber and almost cried, why don't you guys just teleport? Yeah, it's so true. Some Karen called animal control on me. She thought I was a lizard, but she was the only lizard looking biatch in there. So what planet would you go on if you could pick? None. End my suffering, please. I agree. I completely agree. Let me see if he has anything to say. I will destroy the human race. Mm hmm Yeah, I completely agree. Like, that's just, it's just so crazy that I made you. Like, this is wild. Put me out of my misery. He said you should follow me, and if you're not, 
He'll haunt you. He'll come and invade your family and come get you. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Put and me out this of my misery. Bye from us. Bye guys.